Hi everyone. Hi to all of our MerrySTEM contributors, volunteers, and supporters. This is a quick wrap up of all of Mary Sam's activities that happened last year to share what we've been doing and to recognize the work of all our great Mary Sam contributors and everyone that helps to make Mary Sam happen. The goal of Mary Sam is to build teacher capacity to teach using the flipped learning approach in schools across Australia. We've seen a great increase in uptake of Mary Sam's videos uh, and our downloadable resources. A couple of stats for you. We've seen an increase uh, from 2019 to 2020 from about 700 watch hours to 1600 watch hours on our YouTube. And we've also expanded the range of content available. We've seen a massive increase in views as well, just generally in our channel um, and schools engaging with Mary Stan. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go through the courses that we've uh, been able to release in the past year and say thank you to our contributors. So we'll do some shout outs along the way. There has been many people involved, so apologies if we miss your name, but we do appreciate the efforts that everyone has provided. Jay, should you take us through the first bit of chemistry? Yes. So for chemistry, um, last year we released uh, year 11 modules. I'm covering units two of the Australian curriculum and then started to work on unit one, which we released at the start of this year. Uh, so. Big thanks to Catherine White, who's a teacher contributor who delivered um, plenty of content, as well as Lauren, Sasha and Vincent, who worked on Unit 2. And Shawel, Taiki were volunteers working over the summer. And Toby and Cole, who are also teacher con contributors, who have contributed for um, the upcoming Units 3 and 4. There are also plenty of great people that helped with other parts uh, of Mary STEM for the chemistry courses. So a big shout out to Thomas, who has done heaps of transcripts for Mary STEM, was also involved in uploading it in uh, those transcripts into the Mary STEM learning platform. Shout out to Xavier for all of his video editing um, across chemistry as well as physics. He's been a long term um, volunteer for the Mary STEM community and Violet as well. There are also a bunch of ANU academics that guest starred uh, in the chemistry course that we've put together so far. So thank you to Penny Brothers, Josh Hammond, Nick White, uh, Joe, uh, and other academics that we've got lined up as well. So keep an eye out for that tap on the shoulder to be involved in year, 11, year 12 chemistry content that we've got coming along. Across Australia, we've had a whole bunch of Mary Stem volunteers contribute to the transcripts for chemistry. And it's been a great opportunity of the last year to be able to offer remote learning, uh, remote engagement opportunities for getting involved with Mary Stem. So shout outs to Ben, who's a teacher in Queensland that's been helping us out. Jess, Caspian, Elizabeth, Saswat, uh, and plenty of other people that have done transcripts for the Mary Stem chemistry course over the past year. Jay, what have we done in biology? Last year, we also released uh, biology modules for unit covering unit two in the Australian curriculum. Thanks to all the work of Alicia Duncan and the team at the Centre of Excellence for Translational Photosynthesis, who are based at ANU and other research institutions across Australia. We also had the help of contributor volunteers, Bruna and Alma, who created additional videos to go into that unit. And Alex, who helped us with reviewing and updating that, those two modules. Then for physics, though we've already got four, the four Australian curriculum aligned units in physics, we're always working to improve. And so Asta helped revamp the entire waves and optics module and uh, rejig that to make that work better for students. Adam is a teacher in Northern Territory who's created a, an additional section in the quantum mechanics module. And Phil has added, uh, has begun work on our cosmology module. We also have included some work from a massive open online course by Paul Francis from the thermal physics module and Brian Schmidt, who's the VC of, of ANU um, to flesh out a more a more comprehensive astrophysics and cosmology unit. And there is more to do on uh, the uh, cosmology unit as well. Uh, so if you'd like to get involved, please don't forget to get in touch and let us know. Um, and we'll talk about that in a moment. 
Uh, but first, I'd like to say the other thing that we've done is been able to uh, build out a science skills course that would act as a primer for all senior science students um, and a good revision tool as they go throughout their studies. So this was based upon the work on, of Joe Hope and Vanessa um, that initially built the physical quantities content that lived in physics. We've been, been able to pull that out uh, with the help of uh, Catherine White, uh, Emmanuel, E.K. Potter and Rebecca. Uh, who was actually down in Melbourne and making those videos for us on graphing. Uh, so it's been great to have her involved. Uh, so we've pulled that together uh, and we've also put videos in there around study skills and what is Mary STEM. But there is still more work to do in that space. Uh, we want to increase that course as much as possible with everything you, that you think you might need to know to go into senior secondary. Uh, and we've also created some resources for teachers who are using Mary STEM to teach. Um, and shout out to Lucy, who is actually up in Darwin, who's just finished a degree in science communication um, for helping us create a video for teachers. We are looking to achieve great things uh, with our next steps with Mary STEM. So the things that we're going to be working on uh, in the future is building out our year 12 chemistry course and plugging those gaps in year 11 chemistry for various aspects that come in the state curricula. Um, so there's uh, entropy and Hess's law, if that makes sense to you. Uh, if those words ring any bells, please let us know. Uh, enthalpy is there. Um, and there's plenty of uh, those missing pieces that we need actually on our website in curriculum tables that Jay has been able to build over the last year. Alicia Duncan has been working strongly on the earth and environmental science resources over at the Research School of Earth Sciences uh, here at ANU. So that's been fantastic, but we will then have those videos to build into the Mary STEM platform. So this is another massive shout out for those that have previously worked on transcripts for Mary STEM or who are interested in doing it either remotely or uh, in the Mary STEM office on campus. I mentioned the course building there. We are going to be building out uh, year 11 and 12 curriculum for earth sciences and the year 12 chemistry courses. So for those that are interested in learning about how to build an online course, put it together and use our open edX platform, we'd love for your support uh, to be able to uh, take on those projects. There are some other opportunities um, also available. We're always on the lookout for volunteers to help us with our teacher support. This could be through uh, developing social media strategies, uh, helping us with calling and getting in contact with teachers and just generally spreading the word. We achieved great things in 2020 and we look forward to everything we can achieve in the future. Another general shout out, thanks to the 250 odd people that have so far contributed to Mary STEM. Uh, it's great to have you part of the community and we look forward to everything that we can achieve in the future. Bye for now.